Hey guys! Um, so today I have for you my Walmart beauty box. Yay! Um, so this subscription box is I believe still five dollars and it's seasonal. I want to say seasonal. Um, this is their spring beauty box. Um, so I'm just gonna open it up and unbox it and go through it with you guys. Um, so the, when you open it up it looks like this. Um, and as I said, $5, pretty inexpensive. This is what the box looks like. Um, this is definitely, I feel like, a bigger box than last box. Um, I don't know if there's more items in it, but it definitely seems bigger, um, like the actual size of the box. This is the little card that it goes with, and there's hashtag uh, Walmart Beauty Box. It's just a little card. So the first thing that I'm pulling out is this um, Lady Gaga perfume Fame, and it's cute. It says it's the black fluid one, and it smells really good. Um, it says it's. Uh, Tears of Belladonna, Crushed Heart of Tiger Orita with Black Veil of Incense, Pulverized Apricot, and the combin Combinative Essence of Saffron and Honey Drops. It just smells really, really good. Um, so it's just this little sample. Um, this is what the full size looks like, I'm assuming. It smells really good, though. Definitely will consider buying. I don't know what the price is or anything, but as I drop it on the floor. But I don't know what the price is, but I will try to figure it out and then like write it in the the bar down below. Next two things that are in the box are um now this box is only five dollars, so it is a lot of like sample items. Um and not really sample but like travel sizes and stuff like that. But I always think that's great because like the last box I got, I brought most of the stuff that I got in it with me when I went to Florida. So I'm always traveling and picking up things so it's good to have some travel size items just hanging out in your house so then you don't have to go to CVS and spend money and stuff. So these are the Essence Old Time um, Schwarzkopf Omega Repair and Moisture developed with Claudia Schiffer and it's shampoo and conditioner. And it says fast drying for damaged, depleted hair. So I'm assuming it's like a volumizing and also like repairing shampoo and conditioner. I've never tried this brand before, um, but I think, I believe it's decently like high end, like not high end, but more expensive for a drugstore. Um, so I'll have to do more research, but I really... Um, I'm excited to try it out. So those are those two bottles. Um, and these are pretty big uh, trial size bottles. So the next thing which they included um, a... I d actually, I don't think they had a Dove item in the last one. But this is the Dove um, Softer Than Skin After One Shower um, Mandarin and Tierra Flower Scent. So I'm all for like flower scents and everything. I use, um, I actually use Dove um, body wash and I, we in my household, um, all have dry skin in the winter so um, we love the moisture um, line that they have. Oh, but this smells delicious. Mm. Okay, so I will definitely be hiding this from everyone because we have like ones in the shower already but it's so if you haven't tried this line from Dove, the like moisture, the Nutria Moisture line, it's definitely really, really good. So if you have dry skin, especially in the winter time, it just moisturizes your skin really, really well. So definitely go pick this up. Um, the next thing is this Healthy Skin Boosters Facial Cleanser, White Tea and Vitamin E, and it's Neutrogena. And I like Neutrogena's face care. Um, I've never tried this. I think it might be new. I think this actually might be a new um, item that they have. Um, 
it's not, it doesn't smell very good, but it's just, I mean, it's face care, so it doesn't always have to smell good, but I'll definitely have to try it out. It says it won't over dry skin, so that's interesting. It says boost softness, evens, and, ra and radiance won't over dry skin. So, um, it's a facial cleanser, but as I say, like a lot of facial cleansers do dry out your skin. Um, so I'm interested to try this out and see if it actually works how it says it does. The last actual item in the box is from Hard Candy. It's their all dressed up hydrating lip stain. I do not have any Hard Candy products in my collection. Um, I've heard like good things from people on YouTube, obviously. This is in the color Zappy. Um, let's see if I can open it first of all. Okay. Ooh, did I get it? Oh. Nope, not too bad. Okay, so this is the color. It's kind of interesting. It has like actual glitters in it, so I'm not sure if it's going to be super wearable. Um, that's what it looks like on the hand. Um, I'm going to actually put it on my lips and see if the glitters, like it literally has specks of glitters in it. So I'm not sure whether this is going to be a thing for me. Um, I like glitter, but not, I like a sheen. I don't want glitter on my lips. I, to be honest, I don't know how I feel. I'm not really a fan um, so far. Um, I think the glitters and everything make it look like like a three-year-old did my makeup. Um, that's just my opinion. Um, like you know those kits that you get like when you're little and like that sort of a thing that's what this reminds me of um just because of the glitter it's so strong i don't know maybe i'll hold on to it to see like if i use it in like a look or something like if i'm going somewhere or i don't know I don't know how I feel. I feel like it's sort of costumey, um, which for, it is very, I have to say, it's very hydrating. Like my lips do not feel dry now that I'm wearing it, but I just don't know if I like the color for me. Um, I'll have to like get back to you on it, like if I actually use it out. Um, I just don't, I don't really think it's a very wearable color. So I'll have to like, figure out if I if I think that I can wear it and all of that but um it's very hydrating I just as I said don't think it's a very wearable color to be honest it's kind of disappointing because as my first hard candy product I kind of was like excited to try and as you can see there's more stuff in the bottom are actual just like cards and samples and coupons that they give you so the first card that they give you is um, a sample of the Maybelline Fit Me foundation. And they also give you a coupon on the back for $2, which is kind of cool. So if you try it out, you can see whether you like it or not. And um, I actually ended up doing that. Um, I was reading a magazine, and they had um, a little sample of their um, BB cream, Maybelline. This is the Maybelline BB cream. And I actually did really, really like that sample enough to go out and buy it. So sometimes the samples, sometimes when they do something like this, it's good. And then you have that $2 off coupon. And I'm really curious. I have not tried the matte and poreless, um, but everyone's been talking about it. So um, maybe this this will be my opportunity to uh, go check it out and then see if I like it enough to purchase it. Um, the next thing is this. Uh, Garnier New Ultra Lift Miracle Sleeping Cream and as it, it's the same thing they have a little packet here a little foil here and it's another two dollars off 
So I'm all for night creams. I love to put cream on before I go to bed. I just like to feel moisturized. Um, my boyfriend was actually making fun of me last night because he was like, your face is oily. And I was like, no, it's just cream. Um, but I just like the feeling of my face being moisturized at night. So um, definitely we'll be trying this out. Um, the next thing in here, as I'm putting this stuff down, is this Nivea in shower body lotion N nourishing 24 hour moisture which that's interesting oh so it gives you steps so one wash your body as usual two apply in shower body lotion on wet skin rinse quickly rinse off go ready to go so I guess it's it moisturizes it's not a body wash, but it's supposed to moisturize your skin in the shower, which is an interesting idea. So I will definitely be trying this out. And they give you a $1 coupon, which is still good. Um, then the next thing is actually off the product that you got, these two products. Um, it's another $2 coupon off any one Schwarzkopf. Essence Ultimate Old Time Hair Care Product or Stylist Product. Um, so that's nice too. If you end up liking these um, shampoo and conditioner, you have a coupon for it. Um, the next thing they give you a coupon for is the Infallible um, line from L'Oreal, their new line. I have also not tried anything from this line. Um, I have my makeup setting spray that I really, really like, which is the Urban Decay All Nighter. So I haven't really felt a need to try theirs, which is like $10 less, but drugstore. Um, so, I mean, that's obviously a, uh, a guess of the prices, but it's pretty expensive for a drugstore item. Um, but I have heard good things about the Infallible... Um, foundation um, so yeah I'll be interested to maybe get get one tried out see how much I like it um, the next thing is another Schwarzkopf color item um, but this is for a coloring hair product and it's three dollars off then they have a covergirl and Olay um, got together, I guess, and created um, a line for CoverGirl, and they give you a $2 off coupon for that. So it seems like I'm going to be buying a lot of foundation. Um, and then this is just a little um, card for the new um, Maybelline Coming Soon Dare to Go Nude palette. So I actually, looking at these colors, I really, really like them. So I'll be interested to maybe get it and try it out or, you know, see what other people have to say on these colors. I don't think their nudes palette got very good reviews. Um, I don't really know. I'm sure some people liked it, some people didn't. But I think overall, um, people didn't find it, you know, as good of a palette. Um, the eyeshadows themselves were not as good um, as other palettes. So that completes my Walmart box. So as you can see, you get um, a bunch of sample size items, um, but you also get um, like coupons and stuff, which makes it definitely worth the $5 because if you think about it, the travel size alone, the travel items alone cost probably like up to five dollars and then you know even though I didn't like it this is a full size item so you know it's definitely worth your money um, and especially if you like drugstore items and you like to try new things out so um, that completes this little unboxing thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys soon bye